FC Köln were away from home in Stuttgart at Carnival Weekend where they lost 3-0, but here at home it had been three games without defeat this year. They were facing Wolfsburg who hadn't won any of the last five competitive games. 50,000 at the Ryan Enigy Stadion were hoping for another home victory, but the Wolves made the better start. Omar Marmouche, one of four Wolfsburg changes, found Yannick Gerhardt in a bit of space and a former Köln, born and bred player, opened the scoring against his ex-club. Keeper Marvin Schweber not looking confident. FC Köln had more of the possession, but it took 37 minutes before they found a shot and goal. Austrian Dejan Lubacic, seeing the effort gathered by Belgian keeper Kuhn Castils. At half-time, the difference, Yannick Gerhardt's fifth goal of the campaign. Köln were a lot more aggressive in the second period. Captain Jonas Hector was always involved, and defender Timo Hubers had a crack at goal just short of the hour mark. But again, Castiles was perfect on match day 22. An excellent save, keeping his team in the points. Miko Kovac wanted more grit from Wolfsburg, and they won a penalty. 66 minutes into the hard fought fixture, Killian Fischer, on just his second ever Bundesliga start, went down under the challenge from Jonas Hector. The Wolves captain Maximilian Arnold stepped up to do the job. He missed one a couple of games previously against Schalke, but no mistakes this time. First penalty converted back in October. FC Köln never gave up on the game and they had numerous chances to get themselves back in the match, but Davy Selga's best effort was not good enough to beat Kuhn Castiles. Two defeats in a row for Köln. A first win of the year for VfL Wolfsburg, 2-0, the final score.